Oh shit! What do you think about the new uh, pins that are coming the the next major? I think they're pretty cool. So yeah, you can probably hear my fan very well. It's so hot in Sweden, man. It's like 28 degrees. I'm fucking dying. Nice. Now I have to turn off the fan to make video. I'm going to fucking die. So yeah, today's video is not about CS technically. It's about uh, plugins for Chrome or apps for Chrome that I use for trading and buying skins and just general CS related stuff. Because a lot of you people have asked me what sort of apps I use for Chrome and how do I check fast float and how do I like count keys for a trade or whatever. Stupid shit that I thought everyone knew. Apparently they don't. So uh, the first app that I'm going to talk about is of course Steam Inventory Helper. All of you probably have this one. If you don't, you, you're, yeah, I don't even know, dude. So yeah, what it is is basically just a, as it says, a Steam inventory helper. It helps you with everything Steam related. So for example, if I were to send a trade offer to my other account, uh, let's say that I would want to trade for my uh, SG Ariel and I want to give him 50 keys, I'd have to do like this manually. That sucks. I just, with this, right. 46, because I already have four here. Keys, bam, there we go. 50 keys, it says your stuff. 50, keys, 50, so it means that, you know, it's only 50 keys. Their stuff, rifle one. Really easy, really nice. You can also check total price and recount them. So you see my value, 170 euro versus his euro, uh, you know, versus his value. Really good, actually, and helps you count keys quickly if you're checking a trade off if you're checking trade offers or you're sending trade offers it doesn't matter everything just goes so much faster also with this you have a quick sell button so you just click here and it will automatically sell sell it of course you still have to do the mobile verification also you can sell multiple items let's say these four sell four i'm gonna sell them for four euro because i don't really want to sell them i just want to show you how it works now we'll start uh, just throwing all these skins i mean keys on the market so much faster than you would yourself. And you can just put this on while taking a shower or shit, I don't know, and just come back and maybe you've sold all your trading cards or something like that, just to get rid of all those items. I will have to cancel all of these, god damn it. Also, you can set it so that, uh, for example, when you receive a trade offer, you get a notification, a sound notification, uh, when you receive a friend request and a comment, same as that, you can see other people's Steam rep and just a bunch of stuff, which is really useful, just really helps um with steam with working with steam and trading with steam it's very nice the second plugin that i'm going to show you works very well with the steam inventory helper and that's steam wizard now uh, this is actually from the makers of metium if you know what that is the screenshot site and the csgo zone they work together to make this uh i think which is really nice and uh that's pretty cool so what Steam Wizard does is when you're on the market, you can one click check the float of an item. You see, it's super easy to check the float. There's also a button for load all floats. Bam. It goes so much quicker than having to copy this inspect link and going to, I don't know, CSGO zone and check in what float the item has. It takes a lot longer than just clicking one button like this. It's just, this is, this is, this, like, you know, I don't fucking even know what to say, I'll just die. So basically, yeah, this just helps a lot to save your time and just makes everything so much quicker. And if you, for example, find this op Asimo, which has an insane float, it really doesn't now, but if it would have, you could just instantly quick buy, one click buy it. So that's basically the two uh, plugins that I use the most and that I've gotten the most profit from, I guess you could say, because I've managed to snipe a lot of good skins and I've, you know, saved so much time with both of these that I just couldn't live without them. Now, the third one is technically not only CS related, it actually changes Reddit, but since I hang a lot on CS Reddit, you know, CSGO trade or whatever the fuck it's called. Yeah, global offensive trade. This is where I hang, dude. This is my crib, man. The fucking, this is the fucking, what's it called? FBI cribs? No, <laughs> MTV cribs? Yeah. So, Reddit enhancement suite is very nice because it actually uh, just changes Reddit. For example, now you can scroll. You don't have to go to the next page. It helps you with editing your posts. It helps you with viewing the posts. Um, it's just, everything's just a lot nicer. I can't really tell you everything it does because I personally don't even know all the stuff that it does. I just know that Reddit is shit without it. And when I install the plugin, everything just feels better. I, I don't know. 
Maybe it's just the, this this auto scroll thing, which is very nice. Endless scroll or whatever. Maybe it's just placebo effect. Maybe I maybe I'm just fucking retarded. But yeah, th these three plugins are essential when you're trading or just dealing with Steam in general. And the links to all of these will be in the description. And I've just gotten a lot of requests to make a video like this, you know, explaining what plugins I use and what they do and, you know, just stuff like that, dude. It's really nice. So yeah, that's basically it for my video. Hey, that's nice, man. Also, I have a bunch of Kenny S fucking uh, Dragon Lord cases. Might open them, might not. I also have this inventory, which is really cool now. I could make a video on it, I guess. I don't know if you want that. It's just really nice, dude. Just, everything's working out pretty well. Nice.